I'd like to create a document library now. Document library is a place where you can store well shared documents. You can even store web part pages there. It's basically a central point for anybody who needs to share things uh, in support of this site to, to put those objects to share. So for example, later on, we're going to be sharing things like SVG files that we're going to use for display inside the RT graphic or the Pi graphic web part. Now we'll we'll talk a lot more about that later on, how to actually make use of some files in these document libraries for display purposes. But for right now, let's go ahead and create a, a new document library. Now there is a document library that you'll find by default called Shared Documents on your team site. Uh, I, I'd like to go past that and let's, uh, let's build our own specific one for use in this CBT demo. So I'm going to go into Site Actions here. I'll choose Create. Now in the left corner you should see this document library object type. I'll go ahead and create that. For the name of this, I'm just going to say this is where I'm going to put my CBT demo docs. I'll just name it like that. Repository. This is going to be for shared documents and web part pages. You can store web part pages in here as well. And these two options are simply navigation options and uh, revision options. So do I want this to appear in my quick launch? Uh, yes, that's, that's something you'll see over here in the quick launch bar. Or um, also, do you want to create a new version every time you edit an existing document in that document library? I'm going to choose no in this case. It's not that critical that I keep a version history. Now you get to choose what the default document type is. Since I'm, I'm going to store a variety of things, I'm just going to choose None for a default type. I'll go ahead and choose Create. And here is my document library. As you can see, it shows up underneath the list of document libraries next to Shared Documents. If I go back to my CBT demo, yeah, here's CBT demo. You can see now it's got a second document library. It's called CBT Demo Docs. We open it up, we see there's nothing in there now, but this is where I would start uploading files. Now one more way you can find this document library, for example, if you did if you neglected to choose or you chose not to put this on the quick start menu, if you choose view all site content, this brings up a list of all the things in this site, and you can see here's our CBT demo docs.